Hey there guys, what's going on? Today I've decided to make a video um, showing off a design for a um, redstone signal extender that I, I came up with a while ago. Um, I tried for the thing I was building, making just a, I believe it's an RS NOR latch, it's um, uh, this, that's not a torch. It's one of these, where it, um, <laughs> doing this. Uh, one input uh, will toggle the output. Well, yeah, you know what I mean. Alright, so, um, yeah, I tried using that for the thing I was doing, but it didn't actually work for um, what I wanted to do. So, I had to come up with uh, something that did work. <clears throat> now, this is the input. Alright. And now this is the, um, the signal extender. And this will be the output. Okay, so, how it works is you get this, redstone there, and basically you, you alternate this for however long you want it to go. And then you get one of these, and you've got a line going down there. You get one of these in every one of those gaps. Alright, I put these ones on four because um because <coughs> that incre um maximizes the uh amount of um delay per repeater. Alright, uh doing it on these ones doesn't actually do that. Uh these ones extend the signal, whereas this one will just, um, you know, delay the input and output by a, a tick per well, every time you put it up. Um, so basically, you keep doing this. That, that ought to be enough. And these da, da, da. and these okay now um, here we go I'll turn on the input for a moment see the output stays on for a long time but oh wait look the uh, the signals cut out now the reason is this line is longer than 15 blocks the maximum distance that the signal can be carried. So we put that there, and then uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, alright, you check this here, and that ought to extend the signal far enough. See? Ah, but you see that little flash in the redstone? That's because we haven't fixed the delay here. What you do? is you put this down to 3 and that uh, means the the tick added by this repeater is offset by the fact that this one is one shorter so now we'll do that constant signal now you can extend this infinitely um, as long as the chunks are loaded and uh, you can also extend it this way going the other direction to uh, maximize the amount of um of space. Uh, the the amount of delay in your limited building space. Okay, so now that There we go, and now okay. And I'm not sure, but uh, we might get a a flash off. Oh no, we didn't. There was no flash off. Now, this is a momentary input. 
and it lasts for a long time. What I, what I tried to do was just have a big cord of repeaters, basically, um, and the, the toggle at the end. Um, whoops. City dirt. And, uh, that didn't work. Whoops. Because, um, because the delay, the pulse would be sent out and it would go through the big snake, right? And then it would get to the end. So, when you activate it, it would open a door, and then when that pulse reaches the end, it would close the door. But the problem, the problem was, when you activate, when you do it like this, right, you would have two pulses going through the thing, the door would open when the first one went, and then close when the first one ended, and uh, the other pulses ending wouldn't close, would, you know, just re-close the door, even though it was already closed. Um, and that, that uh, did not serve my purposes, because I needed to, um, I needed the door to stay open uh, for the whole duration of the thing pressing the pressure plate and then reaching the door. But, for example, if two people went over the pressure plate quickly, it would screw up the timing. Now, this solved it because, as you saw, no matter how many pulses I send through, the output, it, it doesn't matter. It will always um, stay on until the last pulse, or from when the first pulse goes through to when the last pulse ends. And this design, I have found, is absolutely magnificent. It's also nice to watch. Alright, um, that's it. This is my redstone signal extender. Um, and it's not very resource efficient. It's a fair bit of stone and redstone, because that's a lot of repeaters. But, uh, it works and that's the important thing. I'm sure you could work out a more efficient system using torches um, instead of these repeaters, um, but well this is the the core of the design. This is ultimately what it's about. So yeah, uh, that's it. See ya.